Hey, this is James Scarlett from Scarlett Inc. We've got a movie put together showing you some of the things that Whining and Mill Vision Software have to offer. There's Scarlett Machinery, BMD Machinery. Uh, time Savers, Wima, we've got uh, Onsrud, and then of course Planet Solutions provides all of our software no cost. So uh, what you see today uh, is due in large part to your machinery manufacturers and industry supporters uh, supporting education so you have qualified workforce. Shorter runs, more changes, more flexibility and where you're changing lengths and widths and move this hole there, this kind of cut, and this profile, that profile, this species. It becomes a lot of information for a person to keep up with because typically, you know, the way you get that information to a floor these days is with a piece of paper. You take that to the machines and you say, here's what I want you to run, and uh, you've got to follow, make me six of these, four of these, five of those, and then, then the process starts. So uh, to keep up with the demand of continuously changing customization that you have, guys have to do to stay in your market, it's more and more demand on getting this information streamlined straight to the machines, take the human error out of it so that you don't have people chasing your procedure. Because like almost a foot, how long the board is. That's how it knows if I, if I need to have a 10 foot piece of molding and I lay an 8 foot board up there, it knows it can't use that to fulfill that order. The operator doesn't have to think about that. This value rep knows that information by those sensors. So it has to see if it can choose. Does it have anything else in the cut list? I've told it to cut. That works within that length and that width of that lumber. If it doesn't, then it will. you can set it to either stop and let you take it off, or the blades will open up and it will just run it through without ripping it. So it doesn't deduct it. Now, here's another thing I, I did not mention in there. A lot of times when you're doing the, uh, the, the quoting of material, the mill vision will also back all the way up and say, how do I have any four-quarter cherry to rip? Well, Mill Vision, as you take your, your lumber off your truck, you can create a bunk inventory ticket. You, it's a print out a piece of paper. It puts on with a barcode on your, on your uh, load. So now when they bring that bundle here and they scan it in, uh, they, when it starts taking lumber off of that bundle, it deducts that from your bunk. So in the office, you will get a, You can see that live happening. So during your quoting process, you can see, do I have any four-quarter cherry? Do I have any four-quarter mahogany? You can look at your bunk inventory and determine that. So as this board goes through, it starts deducting it from that, from that bunk, okay? Um, the laser lights that are up here above this, you'll see, that's what shows you the solution onto the board based on what you told it to cut. All the operator is doing is looking to see if that solution is falling on a bad knot. Then he can choose solution number two, and it'll actually go to solution number two, and then he says, okay, run that one. All right? Hide anything other than just, just looking, looking for that, okay? Now, if you can take a quick look here, typically you would have, th this is your saws and your arbor set up, so you would have to enter this cut list and say, okay, I need two of these, five of those, but I need, I need this width, that width, this width, and you could do that standing here touching butting, you know, and, and, and taking the time to do it. But with Mill Vision, you see it has a button, you press Mill Vision, and now Alder is going to tell you your different species that's been released out here to the floor to run. I'm going to mix my molding with his door so it gets a better yield. I can do that right here. I could mix all of these if I so wanted to, but just to keep lumber supplies, I'm going to, you know, a valid, so I'm just going to choose a few that we've done and, and select build here. And as soon as I select build, it's going to create the same information that you would have had to stood here and entered all these tables to figure the width and all. It dumped that same data in here just that quickly. So again, that, that takes, what, 20 seconds and I'm finished. No, no production downtime. The, the, the only deficit you have of time is getting lumber in out of in front of this machine and getting the other bundle in because this thing can change over so quickly now because of the time that you you saved it with the mill vision pushing that data okay all right now those of you that don't know and haven't seen these are moving blades in here they where they where this solution 
falls and moves, these blades will move to match. So that's the concept. It, it, it coordinates that way it can move. You don't have to stop and adjust blades. Therefore, it's, uh, it's very quick, okay? Um, I think we're ready to rip the saw, uh, rip with the saw so he can fire the dust collection up and... Thank you. 